管线。Is breakfast ready yet? I don't want to be late for work. So many things I gotta do. So many things I gotta do. I gotta gotta do. I gotta gotta do. Gotta do. Gotta do. Gotta do. Gotta do. I gotta 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 keep my sanity. Gotta face reality. Hello, Mer speaking. Hey, Mer. Don't forget to get some coffee when you go to the store. We're almost out. Okay. Do you think you can pick up the kids after school today? I have lots of work to do. Uh, sorry, I can't. I'm supposed to meet up with some people around that time. And we might go to Luke's house after that. Are you sure? You know, the kids need help with their assignment. Why don't you skip it tonight? Ah, uh, don't worry. I won't stay out too late. Bye-bye. What a day. It never stops. I work here all day, and then when I get home, I still have more work to do. Don't we all have the same problem? I have a list of things to do, I don't have enough time to take care of them. Hello, this is Marta, can I help you? Oh no! Is she alright? I'll be there in just a few minutes, bye. I have to go to the school. My daughter just fell off the playground. Is she alright? I don't know. I'll find out when I get there. I hope she's okay. I hope so too. Thank you.
My keys, my keys, we're back with my keys. I'll see you later. Okay, bye. Hello, can you send a taxi to Swall Business Office? Oh yeah, a meeting? Meeting with whom, Mr. Budweiser? That is this correct? Yeah, looks, looks okay. Not See, up. the kids need more help with their assignments. I have to do laundry and fold the other clothes and do other chores. Uh, it's not that important. Do it later. You know I can't. The kids need their uniforms, and you also need your uniform for tomorrow. Putting it off now means more work for me later. I yeah. don't understand my math. Can you show me? Let me see. Yeah, looks, looks alright. Uh, well, I can't help them tonight. You'll have to reschedule your work accordingly. Dad, can you help me with my homework? Yeah, that's about right. Sorry guys, can't help you tonight. You'll have to ask your mother. The kids need you. You know, you should really make more time to spend with them. I work from now till midnight. Hey, we both work hard. Anyway, let's hurry up and eat so I can get going. Mom, spoon, spoon, fork, fork. Spoon, spoon, fork, fork. Please don't go out tonight. I really need your help with the kids tonight. I have lots of laundry to do and more chores. Hey, why do you keep saying you're so busy? All you have to do is put the laundry on the spoon, the machine do it for you. And for cooking? <laughs> The machine also do it for you. You don't have to look for firewood anymore. That's right, but it's not just laundry and cooking anymore. The children become my full-time responsibility after school and not to mention my full-time job. I, I never told you to work in an office. You are the one who wanted that job in the first place. Of course. I help you pay for our expenses. You know, we share your responsibilities, but we don't share mine. What do you mean, share responsibility? Well, you're not climbing fat with trees anymore. We buy bread or rice at the market with our paychecks. And let's see, you don't fish like our fathers used to. We spend money on that as well. I thought men are supposed to be the providers of the family. But it seems to me we're spending all my money on food. So? Well, the roles that only men used to do in the old days are now shared by women ever since we started to earn an income. Unfortunately, women's roles are not shared equally by men. I still think you have it easier these days with all these modern technologies. They eliminate the burden on the woman. You don't understand, it's... I don't have time to talk about this right now. I'm gonna be late. Why don't we bring this up tomorrow? at the Barris meeting, then see what everyone else has to say about it. Then maybe you can stop your complaining. Okay, fine. Have a nice night. Bye.
thank goodness her leg was okay. I told her to be more careful next time. She should be playing with her own peers, with the girls. But you know, she said it's boring. She said the boys were just jealous because she shoots better than they do. Ha, ah, that sounds just like my husband. Guys don't understand that women's roles are different than before. As a matter of fact, we were just talking about that last night. Weren't we, Carlos? You know, my husband and I talk about this all the time. Our husbands ignore the fact that we are not just housewives. We hold jobs just as they do, but still, we take care of the kids and we still finish all the chores that we're required to do. Looks like your husband needs to buy you a washing machine and an electrical stuff. That should solve all your problems. You don't understand. Someone has to operate these things. They don't just do the work by themselves. Give me a break. You should admit that you work these days is easier than it was in the old days. Just think how difficult or hard your work would be if you take your laundry and go pound your clothes by the river or by the stream. But in those days, women worked together. We sat by the stream and we talked and we laughed. Well, we did laundry. Not only that, but responsibilities used to be divided between our relatives. And we all know that many hands make work light and easier. A job is not someone's job. It's more of everybody's job. Uh, yes, but remember, this new machine makes, uh, makes it easier for you. So now you don't need the rest of your family or relatives to help. Yeah, now you have an electric stove, hand and hopping, a rice cooker, and a microwave. Do you want to go back using iron buck over a fire? No, but we're the only ones who ever use microwave and oven. I've never seen you in the kitchen. In the old days, men would cater the wood and they'll prepare the fire, and women do the other half by cooking over the fire. And even earlier than that, daily cooking was done in earth ovens. And guess who was in charge of building them? Thank God, we don't have to do that anymore. I remember a recent funeral I went to where we had to build an oven. I mean, it was no big deal for me, but some of the guys were getting really tired. Yeah, it took strong guys to do work like that. Yeah, you men used to contribute a lot over meal times. Just think about food preparation. Now women have taken over the kitchen almost completely. Men used to do their part. Men would gather the bread fruit and then pound it before the women prepared it for eating. Men took care of the pigs too. They would feed them and then butcher them before we ever started cooking. Let's not forget about fishing. Nowadays, I go to the market to buy fish. In the old days, men battled their canoes out and catch fish for our dinner. Now those were the good old days. What? You think it was easy for you back then? Don't think men did all the fishing. Women didn't get to dance every day. Often they would go out with nets and catch plenty of fish. Women in Plow didn't have it easier either. They work in the taro patches. And women in the other islands still do that. Yeah, but the difference is we do all the work by ourselves nowadays. Back then, we used to work with our friends and relatives. What do you still have to admit it? that it's so much easier for women today. Who needs help when you've got stores and packaged foods? You just run to the grocery store and come home and eat. There's nothing to it. Oh my.
my goodness, is that what you think? I suppose you think house cleaning is easy too. Do you think those dishes wash by themselves? Well, no. Just think about what it would have been like in the old days. You would have had to clean with a little broom made out of coconut fibers. Aren't you glad you don't have to do those kind of housework anymore? Just use a little soap and everything will be clean. You don't get it, do you? We cook, we clean, we wash, we rake the yard, and we do it all while we take care of the kids. We love the kids. The kids are wonderful, but it's hard taking care of them and doing everything by yourself. I have to work eight hours a day outside the home just like my husband does. But still, I have to look after the kids and do all the other chores. Don't you guys get it? Both she and her husband have jobs outside their home, and on top of her job, she has to do all the family chores, including taking care of the children. And without the help of the other relatives, like in the old days. Sometimes children are so demanding that we need all the help we can get. If the husbands are not around to help, then we, we're in trouble. You know, nothing can be done, and the children get into trouble. Sure, but there are fewer of them these days. I remember we had 11 in our family. Man, we were naughty, except for me, of course. No doubt you all were troublemakers, but don't forget, your mother had plenty of help raising you. She had relatives, she had cousins, she even had neighbors around to help her. Yeah, I remembered. They were like police. They watched me all the time. Now that was the good thing about those good old days. Everybody helped each other. Now I don't even get enough help from my family. Uh, what do you mean for crying out loud? I bought you that washing machine. <laughs> <laughs> Couldn't any of your children help you fix dinner or do the laundry? All of them have their own activities. One have volleyball, practice, the other one she's always studying for an exam. And the little one, of course, he's way too little to fix dinner or do laundry. I know what you mean. Mine are always busy with school projects or homework too. They come home for dinner and off they go. They don't share responsibilities at home uh, like we used to with our parents in the past. School has become so much more important these days. I remember I used to babysit for my younger siblings. I was only nine years old when I started to babysit for my brother and sister so my mom could take care of cooking, washing, and weaving. Yep. I used to help my father prepare the food. I sometimes helped to pick the bread food. I learned how to fish from my grandfather and I helped my father fish as well. Yeah, I was a good helper too. Whenever my dad would go out working, I was there doing my part. These days, my sons don't help me with my work, but I'm always helping them with schoolwork or homework. Well, there's something that we all can agree on, kids, they take so much time nowadays. Yeah. yeah, a lot has changed. Women have less support from family members and they have extra responsibilities with their paying jobs. Yeah, it's funny when you think about it. There didn't seem to be as much to do in the old days, even without all our modern conveniences. I guess responsibilities really were more balanced. Speaking of responsibilities, we have three at home waiting for us. 
we should be going. Yeah. See you later. Thank you. We need to stop on the way to get some bread and eggs for the kids' breakfast tomorrow. Oh, come on. You worry too much. I'm tired and I want to rest. We'll do that tomorrow morning. I won't have time in the morning. I need to go to work early to print up this report for my boss. Boss? What boss? What about this boss? Well, this boss should try running the house and taking care of the children for once. You heard what they said in the meeting. It is tough for women nowadays. You should experience my world to understand. Hmm. I have better things to do than to run your little errands. Oh, I see. Don't think you can handle it, huh? Are you challenging me? You bet I am. Let's see how you can run our household tomorrow. You stay home all day and run the house, okay? How about that? Well, okay. Why not? I'll do your work for one day. I'll show you how easy it is. And then maybe you stop trying to convince me how hard it all is. Now, come on. Let's go and rest. Hey, we need to stop on the way to get some bread and eggs for the children's breakfast in the morning. What is this? Where's the eggs? Where's the toast? Don't worry, this is a healthy breakfast. Okay, just put some of this on. Is moving. Could you come back here and help me, please? Sorry, gotta go. I need to get my report ready. Don't forget to put the clothes out on the line when the machine stops spinning. Oops, 
Who needs a white shirt anyway? Yay, 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 Well, looks like it's gonna be a long day. Thank goodness. You're fine. I, I need some help. Help? Are you sure? It looks like you're doing fine. Mom, you're back! That's it that we're gonna eat rice again. Well, you talk to him. He's in charge. I'm gonna go and watch TV. What? Wait! I admit it. The job is much tougher than I thought. I can't do it all by myself. Oh, yeah? All right, that's all I really need to know. Terry, you go to the store and get some chicken. Kathy, you go help Tani clean up the toys, okay? And you, go fold the clothes and put them away. Whatever you say. Whatever you say.